Hello my friends, and welcome back to our continue buying Let's Play The Legend of Dragoon for PlayStation. My name is The Flightless Bird, this is your story based gaming channel, and today, today we're on the Phantom Ship. Yeah, I keep calling it Ghost Ship, but I guess Phantom Ship is named for it. Uh, we're here in Chapter 2, Platinum Shadow. We got Kongol and Shauna in our team. Although, I don't think Kongol's can be exceptionally useful on this boss. It makes me wonder if I should use him or not. Oh. Uh, so when I look at status, so level 21, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 20. Yeah, I think I'm gonna take Kongol out for uh, this upcoming, what I assume to be boss fight. Well, let's get into it, shall we? I hope you're all having a wonderful, fantastic day here. As we open up the door that's not locked anymore. Trying to brave your amulet. Let's go check that out. Bravery amulet avoids abnormal status fear. Hmm. I think I may use that. <laughs> I may think I may have to use that. By the way, I did change up my party. I put in Albert instead of Congo. The reason I put in Albert is because he actually has a little bit of usefulness with his damage mitigation move. And I was thinking of putting in Rose. But she has the least amount of HP. And that kind of scares me a little. I was thinking also about putting in a Hashel. But I just, I feel good about Albert. So, yeah. He's in the party. Huh? You, black monster. How dare you come here pursuing Princess Luvia. But as long as we are here with her, we are not gonna give her up. We are not the black monster, we are. How dare you, monster, using human words to fool us. Unforgivable, even if it costs like my life, I won't give up for Princess Luvia. I, I also was thinking about putting Rosie just for story reasons, but since we're fighting undead, I don't want my abilities to backfire. So if I drain an enemy, I don't want it to heal it and kill myself, which is a thing in other RPGs. I don't know about this one, but yeah. Interesting how Rose stepped aside too. But then again, they called Dart the black monster. Hey, if you heard me said using human words when Dart spoke. So that means that maybe it's not it's not that simple. Okay, that really hurt. So I'm assuming that these guys are... I'm assuming that these guys are... Hmm... Bosses. So I'm gonna target the Goat's Commander here. The reason for that is that I'd much rather have Dart Special. Having Shauna special might be good too, because she'll probably do a lot of damage. But when you go to physically attack, Dark has the most attack. Alright, that 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 made my choice for me. That made my choice for me. Her special is amazing. She's got the Sailor Moon type yes. transformation there. Except she needs a shimmer. It's got a shimmer, you know? Yeah, uh, by... The reason I said that made my choice is because uh, when you are transformed, you can't get sass affected. So by transforming uh, with everyone, Dark transforms and therefore he doesn't get sass affected anymore. Uh, so yeah, we use Star Children here. And we hope this does a ton of damage. We hope this does a ton of damage. Star children. Did that just knock him down? Oh, 
okay. I'm a little confused, but at the same time... At the same time, uh... The Star Children seem to work really well. Just knock four of them down. Although the problem I have is he's probably gonna get back up, isn't he? Rose Storm! Now, Shana can't heal herself. Well, she can heal herself, but don't want to heal herself. I, I, I'm kind of wasting her special here, but at the same time... Same time, she can't die. Well, that would suck. Okay, now we final burst. Much rather have had him special to final burst because it would have done a ton more damage. But it's all right. It's all good. It's all good. I want to kill this guy before all those things resurrect, because I have a feeling they can resurrect. Not be bad. 549 is really, really good, though. That's really good damage. Top tier right there. Yeah, I saw this one coming. Only one of them resurrected, though. Nope, 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 never mind. They're all going to resurrect. They're just taking their sweet time doing it. Huh, only one did. Uh, let's go out to the commander here. Commander is down. So didn't, really, didn't really feel like a real boss. I'm gonna be a little disappointed if I wasted my SP on enemies that aren't real bosses. Be great if Shana moved next, since I know Shana can knock all these guys down. And I need to knock them down before the big guy gets up. Perfect. Good fight. Good fight. This should end the fight, right? Should end the fight, possibly, maybe, theoretically. Yeah. Star children. That's so much damage. Partly because she's a light unit, and these guys are dark, I imagine. I know this idea of bring robes. I like that little musical ditty. That was pretty good. 6,000 EXP. Ooh, a new addition! Madness Hero. And everyone leveled up off that. Our levels are kind of balanced out now. You know, there was a time that they weren't, but now they're kind of set. Ah! It looked like you just seen a ghost. Defeat the Ghost Commander is four nights. Princess, Princess. Shauna. It's over. There is no more black monster. Oh, please, please suffer no more. You, you are. I? Thank God you made it, Princess Luvia. You're treating her like the princess. Well, wait. Is there still something that I don't know about? Huh? The door is open. Yeah, I'll, I'll be back. <laughs> let me go use the um. Uh, let me go. Uh, let me go take a nap, and uh, we'll come back like you know, eight hours later.
I just get the feeling like that wasn't the real boss. And that's kind of worrying considering I do not have I do not have full Dragoon points anymore. But at the same time, I'm hoping that it won't be a big deal. Should also check around the room. See nothing, okay. Let's head on it. So far I was right about there being another boss. Fired a dancing dagger. This was Final Fantasy IV for the Enterprise. That wouldn't be a bad weapon. As it stands, is it a good weapon? Yeah. Oh, uh, that's pretty nice. I lose the darkness based attack, but it's pretty nice. All the exclamation marks. Princess Luvia, she was still young. She wasn't a princess of Melissa's too. This wouldn't have happened. Princess of Melissa's too? Oh my, you are. Alive. Oh lord, it was not in vain. I have been wandering for 18 years and longing for you. I can now end everything. I can go to the place where everyone is. Wait, what kind of relationship do I have to this person? Well, if you want to believe all the ghosts, you are the person, princess. Huh? Yeek! Oh, said that a little bit too loud. Sorry if I just broke your eardrums. <laughs> I do have something on my computer that makes so it, my volume will be deadened if it hits a certain volume, but yeesh, I did not mean to do that. The ship is sinking? Oh, everything is... Everything is fixed and under control in the engine room now, sir. Now, let's relax away for Dart and the others come back. Can I get the dragon stone for Meru, please? Like, when does that happen? I really want to know. Whoa! Kayla, get ready quick! Everyone, hurry up! Dart Rose, quick, quick! I'm oh, sorry, that was Mero. Dart! Oh, Dart! Let's go, we are the last ones. Oh, that was Albert. I, I don't know who's talking up here. Ah! Rose, let go, you gotta live. This is the same as back then. Really? No, I won't let go. I will never let it happen again. Rose? Maybe this is her dark secret. Dart, Rose. I have no idea who's talking, I'm sorry. Dart. Oh my God. Commander Bueller, pull out the life raft quick! Rose fell in with us. She saved my life. She's. Dart and Zeek, they are so much alike. Not only are they dragoons recognized by the red-eyed dragon, but there's something else, something that attacks me. Interesting! Hmm, maybe this is her dark past. She was with a man named Zeke. Hmm. Uh, I'm still wondering though if it, it said. It, it did say that, um.
she did say this is just like back then. I was thinking maybe she was, she became the black monster and killed Zeke. Maybe she let Zeke drop. And because of that, she went insane and then became the black monster. Like the, the, like his death triggered that in her. Or maybe I'm just completely wrong altogether. And the reason that uh, sh she has this hanging over her head is because of what I originally said, which is that she had a chance to kill the black monster but failed. And because of that, she blames herself for everything that's happened. Hmm. She does seem to really like Dark, though. After 11,000 years of time, I now feel the strength and tenderness of Dart. And again, here's, here's the thing. I, uh, I'm sorry to interrupt constantly, but here's the thing. If, if I, I thought the Black Monster appeared like 18 years ago or something. So it, it's not likely that she is the Black Monster because that wouldn't... Unless the Black Monster has been around for a very, very long time. I mean, do we know how long the Black Monster has been around for? Uh, I just feel... I, uh, I wish I knew more about her. And even his frailty, these tame the insanity of the Dagoon for me. Either way, she seems to really like Dark. Zeke, if my hands could grab him, I wouldn't have had this bitterness. Oh, now this is cool. What's going on here? Heck is that? Oh, Kansas! oh this is uh, cool. Uh, not bad. I'm taking you with me. Dude, that guy's awesome. Just sacrificed himself to save all his friends. Dude, what a hero. What a legend. Oh. That's a barrage, isn't it? We fought that thing. So is this 11,000 years ago? Who are you? I forgot the guy's name, but the big bad from like 11,000 years ago, that might have been him. Yeah, there's that Farage. like before. This is exactly what happened. I want to see more! I saw Zeke and Dart. But Dart is Dart. He is not Zeke. No, he is not Zeke.
So we gotta catch fish now and feed him. And if we don't get enough fish, then um then he dies. Then we throw ourselves off the cliff. Oh hi little doggy. Pooch, what's wrong? Oh my god, there's somebody there. Well, now we may know why they give us a sword for her. It looks like it's just the two of us. Pooch, you like him, don't you? I was surprised. Nobody would think there are people there. We are safe, thanks to you, Pete. We have to take Pooch, too. By the way, are you in love with each other? Because you two are traveling alone. Ah, uh, do you think so? I think so. Don't they look it? Yes. Yes, you make a good couple. Don't be silly. We were just looking for our friends. Actually, there are seven of us. Okay, but you don't need to be shy. <laughs> Do we have to get her fish? Are you sick? It's nothing. <laughs> Actually, we should have been to the uh, clinic in the neighboring town. Neighboring town? It's Fino. There's a port and they have a boat to Dineau. You know what? The Queen Fury might have dropped by. But why don't you take your mother to Fino? Because there's a monster on the way in the undersea cavern. I know, we really have guests, but we have to let them go, Pete. Mr. Dart, I hope you can meet your friends soon. I, I hope so, too. Say hi to everybody, okay? Immediately, I run back inside. That's what you do. Bow, 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 bow. All right, here's the kitchen. The tools are neatly placed. Right, it's a map of the Endonesian continent. It must have been bought in Fuego. In Fuego! Guys look strong. The armored swords are cut on you. Can't talk to the mom. Nope. And no um Stardust. I don't know, my brain like mentally stopped there for a second. I didn't know what to say. I didn't know what the word was. I knew it was Stardust, but I didn't know how to say it. I just went, no. How do we open this? Okay, we got a gate back here that we can't open. Uh, Ocean Terrace. I have a feeling the pure is progress. A sea dragon is making a mess of Alyssa Bay. It's too dangerous to go fishing. Hey, I was this close. It's a great day today. It's a great day for fishing. If only one no sea dragon. Ouch, I shouldn't have flinched that.
We fishermen are gonna bust cuz we cannot go fishing. Hey, thanks. I made it Well, a mayor shouldn't be out playing, but I cannot go fishing anyway. Hey, hey, I'm really lucky today Yeah, we're lucky you're not gonna eat Recently monsters appear in the undersea cavern. It's too risky to go to Fuego. Come on be good to me, baby How to talk to these people it's not that we're far to find out how we can't use a ship on the undersea cavern. Come on, be good to me, baby. Alright, it looks like we're going to uh, the underground cavern next. Ah, da 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 da. Uh, there was one right now. I wonder if it's drinking water. I need some water. Just start coughing like really hard for a second there. Look at those guys on the terrace. Just because they cannot go fishing, they are so can just run around. <laughs> yeah, they are. How about that, those guys are not being able to go fishing, uh, fishing and just looking around. That was weird. Uh, it could put it could put a chill on even a 100 years of love really okay uh, the bed doesn't sag I uh, dry fish are hanging everything in my house things to one side what am I gonna do you know when I was younger one of the first apartments I owned was owned by this guy who um it wasn't really an apartment it was more like a house I was living in I was living with some other people. But either way, uh, the only room that I had in the house, the only room that I could really afford. Well, there were two rooms I could afford. One room, there was no lock to the door. Uh, the, the, the room was just a room that anyone could come in at any time because there was no way to lock the room. I didn't choose that room because I didn't feel safe. The room I did choose... Pete's mom really was a good woman. She lost the hobby to see when Pete was so low, but being the woman she is, she worked hard and raised Pete. But as fate would have it, Pete's mom became ill. Now Pete's got to take care of her, but she's got to go to Fuego as soon as possible to be treated. There's a hot spring in the Fuego Clinic, and it's famous for working miracles. I've always wanted to go there, although I've never had the chance. But I heard it really works. And the guy next door had his strain back and went there. Pete's mom really is a good woman. She lost the hobby. Okay, so that's the same. But uh, anyway, so... Uh, the one room I did have had a busted window that the guy promised he would fix and never did. Um, and a room that was slanted. No, I'm just gonna... Takes too long to click through that. Um, yeah, the room was slanted. So my chair to my computer would like roll downwards all the time. And it was not a good living condition. It wasn't. Plus, the contract that he made me sign to agree to live there was a really ridiculous contract. It, it, it basically said, you know, I agreed to clean up his house as a part of living in that room. And it was just a really bad situation. Hey, we gotta start us. But you know, I was young. I didn't know any better, and I had to find a place to live, and I was poor. So, I mean, what am I gonna do? I mean, not much has changed since then, uh, uh, but, you know, I do have a job now, and I do have the ability to live in a condo that doesn't have a book window and doesn't have a slant, which is great, so I'm really happy about that. The game the man and the others are playing for is for three guys. I got left out, so I'm here. I want to go fishing. Thought he was going to let me come across. But yeah, that's just a nightmare living scenario, let me tell you. It just sucked. Dart! Huh, huh, what's wrong? Would you please take us to Fuego? I'm afraid of the monster, but we gotta go before it's too late. It's about your mother, isn't it? I, I wanted to be in the hospital. You got it, we'll take you there. 
I can annihilate the monster for you. <laughs> I love the confidence. And we just back so we're like, whoa! Did I say something wrong? No, it's just you said it in such a way it kind of scared us. Thank you. I'll bring my ma. What are you looking at? And now that I was just really forceful. On the road again. On the road again. All right, let's look at our stuff here. Okay, we got a power wrist. I don't think I have any other, like, strong weapons. Nope, I do not. Uh, let's see. Uh, you already have the best? No, you have a panic guard. Alright. Additions. Man is hero. It's got five edition now. Holy cow. Oh, she has a new edition as well. Hard blade. Five editions as well, too. Dang. Well, I, I have to get her to get more and more uh, max out first, though. So it's not a big deal. Give me a chance maybe to learn darts before we move on to hers. The Undersea Cavern. Hopefully we don't have to fight the dragon with just the two of us. Because they did mention that there is a dragon in this place. Since the monster appeared, the water has never ebbed, but it's okay, because Quaino is not this way. Oh, I, I'm assuming that the monster is the dragon that was mentioned in the other town, right? Because in, uh, what was that place called? Uh, to know? They mentioned a sea dragon. A lot of fishies. Okay. Sea prana. Wow. It's still alive? Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and hit this. It's not the smartest thing to do, but I may not be able to attach it first try, and if I just hit it, I'm pretty sure it's gonna die. Yes. Go. Ooh. Okay, that that that's um it, it seems to go really, really fast. Not super fast, but fast enough. Can you stop hitting dart please? You should not get like 15 turns. Hush, die. More and more. You're ridiculous. Yes. Go. Oh, that's that's a little bit tricky. Gotta do it quickly. My goodness, they just keep attacking Dark. I, and Rose hasn't been hit once. Dark got hit like six times. Why is that a thing? I hate it when they get double moves like that. So unfair. They still are going to be getting a lot of experience. This is only two in the party. Wait. Another transition? Really? That quick? Huh. That was really fast. I thought we'd have to go through that dungeon to fight the monster. Look at this guy. Is this a rare monster? Yes. Go. <laughs> the next hero. Nice. 
No, it's not a rare monster, also we don't rare monsters you only do one damage to. Hopefully give a chance to dart to fully heal here. Well, not fully heal, but mostly fully heal. The city of Fuego. Yeah, that was uh very easy. Like very easy. Kind of weird to add two towns back to back. Kind of was two towns. Here we are, Fuego. I know there was a little dungeon between, but that wasn't much of a dungeon. Thank you, Dart and Rose. Uh, you have to get better soon to make me happy. I hope we can find your friends soon. Uh, thanks. Just go take care of mom, please. But are you actually in love with each other? Because in that cave, you, um... <laughs> I just want to kill him. You are a good boy and didn't see anything, okay? Okay, I didn't see it, baby! <laughs> Mommy! <laughs> uh, it's nothing. We're going... Well, that was weird. Rose, you gotta confess to him. Are you little? Kids. <laughs> what are you looking at? Uh, been nothing. I'm sure. I don't want to get killed, so I'm just gonna say nothing. It's a stylish lamppost, just like it should be in a tourist city. Check out my wares? Sure, what do you got? Uh, healing potions, healing breezes, sun rhapsody, prayers. None of the stuff that I need or want. This doesn't say repeat on it. So I'm just gonna take the tingle. And if it was a repeatable item that I could have used to abuse stuff with, oh well. The idea of just destroying an enemy by using an item doesn't really appeal to me anyway. I mean, it's much better to use your SP, I mean, your attacks to gain SP, to learn additions. Oh look, he ran from the bottom to the top. Oh, that was cool. I like that. Ooh, better weapon. Better weapon. I'm going to pick up one of these. Yeah, I'm going to pick up one of these to have. Although, someone please remind me. I think I have a couple more stars already. Uh, plate mail, play defense, less magic defense. Sure, why not? Sparkle dress, just great. Oh my god, look at that magic defense. Not only the magic defense, but when attack SP is accumulated. Oh, he's got... He's, that's what that is. So he, he's constantly gaining SP because of that. Hmm. I like how the guy runs up and down. Yeah, that's really cool. That's a cool shopkeeper. Look, look, lots of aunties are carrying a grasshopper. All creatures will slip by making some sacrifices, don't they? That reminds me of Dead Rising when I had to sacrifice people to get out. Everything is well maintained, just like it should be in a tourist city. Welcome to Fuego, the town of relaxation and commerce. Is this is all hot springs? We cannot put our ship out of sea, so we have no choice but to kill time bathing in the hot spring. Yeah, life is tough, huh? We got about work and soaking a hot spring. Oh, what can make me happier? I don't know. It goes in the way that's. Anyway, moving on! Danger flightless. Oh, 
Wait. Both rooms take you to the same place? Huh? But they're two different rooms. Ah! They're two different rooms, so they take you to the same place. That's so weird. Unless it's not the same place and that's someone different. Yeek! Coming out of bath with with your armor on is unforgivable. Okay, so is this the is this the girls one? I mean, it's kind of probably because the only thing she really cares about is the fact that we have armor on. <laughs> hey, dude, you should come to the other shower over here, or the other bath. It's a nice day today. It is a nice day today. I hope you all having a great day. That looks like a great place for a stardust. It is. Sounds, smells good. Seems like it's best here. That looked like a perfect spot for a stardust. And yeah, I'm still clicking on everything. You may have more than one stardust in one place. You never know. You never know. Excuse me. Sorry. All, 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 but all rooms are full. If you really want to stay here, come back on another day. Oh, I can't even go up that way. Yeah, I thought I was talking to him at first, but actually, you just can't go that way. Left downtown, right steps port, front steps spa. Well, before we go down, I want to go up here. This is probably like the, uh, the nursing area. With this strange gizmo. No, it looks like a hotel. If you'd like to have regular treatment, go upstairs. Ouch, ouch, my, my stomach. I pushed my luck and ate 10 eggs. Okay. Maybe don't eat 10 eggs. This having an illness that is not curable, even with clinical rays. I swings on my last chance. This doesn't work. Oh, poor kid. Oh, that sucks. All sorts of balls are lined up. It seems like medicines for treatment. Oh, here's a kid. Hey, Dart, did you find your friends? Oh, well, but you will find them soon. Thanks to you, I made it to hospital. I really appreciate it, you too. When I go up, I'm gonna be a swordsman just like you, Dart. That was nice. Oh, same thing, I guess. Yep, same thing. Coming up here. Oh, the dog's up here. So I forgot to pause it and became yellowish. Hi, buddy. Dream, I'd like to be treated that enter here. No, I really don't need to be treated. I am good. Okay, let's head to the next area. The reason I'm not saving is I don't really don't feel like I need to save right now. I mean, I'm not expecting this place to be attacked by anything. Hopefully. Hopefully. Oh, it looks like there's a Queen Fury, or it's some sort of ship. The boat hasn't come and I cannot get in any sock. The boat hasn't come and I have nobody to sell to. I can't do any business. I want to abandon the sand like my neighbor, but I have nothing to do and I'm bored. Uh, if it's, if it indeed is the intersection of south and north, there are all sorts of goods being sold here. Hey, look, it's Queen Fury. Gosh, Queen Fury is too cool. Yeah, hopefully I can find my friends here as well. Hopefully they didn't move on without me. Well, and that's storm, even for the powerful Dart and Rose. Huh? Y you are. Ah! Mr. Dart, Miss Rose! Oh, what's up, kid? I had you worried, huh? Thank God, both of you are safe. Well, that was nothing. Oh, did you see Miss Shauna? Please go see her, hurry. 
She has spoken words. It's even. She has spoken even in words. It's disappeared. Is she on the boat? Everybody's in the city now. So where is she? I, like just went through the city. Please go see Miss China and hurry. Your friends are staying at a hotel downtown, so Miss China can rest. Okay, so the uh, the hotel that I couldn't go into before is probably where I need to go now. What's that? I'm just waving to the camera. Hi, everyone. Hi, Dart. How you doing? This is so weird. I, I really hope that's him waving to the camera. Some sort of fourth wall breakage. That would be cool. And it must be very hard to carry all this. We are still fixing the engine room and we are all rushing around in the ship. We better not go in the ship. Alright. Very well. Oh, Meru! Ouch, don't you like have eyes? Meru? O-M-G! Dirt! Rose! I knew it! You guys are alive! Did you like see Shauna? Bad boy, come with me quickly! Like, hurry up! We're in the hotel, come quick! I remember playing a game, I forgot what it was called. I, I, I don't remember anything about it except for, I think it was Lemo was her name? Yeah. Um, a Star Ocean. Star Ocean 4. Not a bad game, but her voice. And she would say like, um, gee, or something like that in this really like drawn out way. And it was just so annoying. Hmm? She said the hotel. I mean, pretty good character wall, just not the best socialite. Mara, where is she? Who am I? Oh, huh? Whoa! People just magically appeared. Like, you guys are slow pokes. Well, come back. Hi, Albert. Wait, uh, we were tired of waiting for you. Hi, Hassel. You die impossible. Hey, Congo. Everybody except Shauna. Where's Shauna? How does a giant Congo sneak up on you, by the way, Dart? Hurry, go see Shauna. She is in the back room upstairs. And he's off. Like, let's leave them alone. Rose, she has changed somehow. I agree. Indeed, I get the impression that she has come down. In any event, it's a good thing. Shana. It's so bright. I hope our future is bright too. Oh, that's so sweet. Everything is maintained perfectly. Every last thing is so well maintained. Okay, normally in a game like this would be the farthest spot you go, but let's see. It is. Okay, good. Nothing. All right, we here need time. Oh, poor girl. Shauna! Dart? Oh, Dart! I made you worry. Are you crying? <laughs> it was nothing. I'm happy just like this. Aww. Peeking is not a ladylike thing to do. Wait, what? I thought you wanted to leave them alone, didn't you? Huh? 
It's okay for me. I gotta learn about love and romance. You guys go back. Or we're gonna get caught. Oh, I thought that was a fourth wall breakage where they were like, hey, uh, we're gonna leave them alone and this room was gonna go black and we would be like kicked outside. But no, there's someone watching out door outside our door. Kids. Open the door and everyone falls through. Yes! Awesome! That's amazing! <laughs> Ah, uh, please excuse us! Oh, that's great! Haha, -ha, it's typical of Meru. Finally, you smiled. True, it's been a while. Sha la 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 la, don't be shy, shy. Come on now, you gotta kiss the girl. Oh, yeah. I really need to look at the words to that song, because I don't. <laughs> I don't know it. And this and that and so on and so forth. We finally made it to Fuena. And it's only that. You tore us safe and sound. It's just a miracle that the seven of us can meet again. We have to offer our thanks to the Tiburon God. Ah, we ought to return the favor to the God by taking the Moon Dog back. Wait, we have to get to Lettuce then. Uh, like, may I ask you a question, please? Uh, what's wrong? Why are you being so formal like that? Well, you guys were all alone in the cave, weren't you? Did you guys, like, put yourselves into, um, a, um, a romantic situation? But, Mary, don't be silly. Even though you were trying to learn about love, it's too rude. Okay. I, I really don't think she's 16. I, I know Kyle told me she was 16. She's not 16. She's, like, 13. Or 14. She's she at most. Maybe she's 12. Cause there's no way she's 16 and is like this. I, I, the only thing I can think of, maybe she was 16 in the American version, but in the Japanese version she was actually like 12. Uh, I know games like the Atelier series, uh, they do that as well. And when Atelier Ramona came out, I believe she was supposed to be like 13 or 12, and then they aged her up to like 17 or 18. They basically added five years to all the characters without changing anything about them. So they still looked exactly the same. They still talked exactly the same. They still acted exactly the same. The only thing they did was in the manual, they aged them up like five years. Uh, so Dart, uh, did you cuddle with Rose? Hi, show! <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry, you slipped out. Uh... What do you mean, slipped? <laughs> Don't worry, Shanna. Dart was concerned about you the whole time. Any anyway, about Nanus. We should go out and ask about her in the city. We may find out something. I, I agree. Okay, uh, I'm gonna take Rose. And I'm going to take Hashel. I really want to take Marrow. But the fact she still doesn't have a Dragon Stone means she's gonna be sidelined until she does. And I think that's unfortunate. But it's kind of necessary. Now, the good news though is when she does join my party, she's a very fast character. So she'll be able to probably catch up at a much faster speed than, let's say, Albert or Congo would. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead. I know both these guys have a ton of additions they need to work on. Uh, Hassel's a level 2 Dragoon. Um, so I know Congo's also level 2 Dragoon, but I just used him. And I try to alternate characters as much as I can. And Rose, uh, it's been a while since... I think it's been a while. Yeah, uh, we'll, we'll use Rose as well. Uh, let's get rid of Bandit's Ring. Because I think the Bandit's Ring is like the best accessory in the game. Uh, no matter who you use it on. Uh, you could use it on Hashel for additions. You could use it on Rose for additions. I think I'm going to use it on Hashel. Because if I look at his, he's furthest behind. 
Also, I need to go into equipment. I, I know, I'm sorry for pressing so many buttons. I need to go into equipment and I need to equip Shana with her Amusing Arrows. Reduces attack hit by 10%. Increases damage by six. Confuses enemy. Okay. That's a, not a bad little item. Okay, it looks like there's something going on up here. You don't believe me either? I really saw it. I saw a dragon on Prison Island. Dragon on the Prison Island? You don't know that. My ship was smashed by the sea dragon, rumored to live over the undersea cavern. I gotta have a drink or something. But you cannot go there anymore. There are lots of monsters there. My house was taken by those monsters. I gotta have a drink. It was half a year ago that the monsters showed up. <laughs> it just, <laughs> it just fell over. It was all the monsters' fault. But I'm like this out. Get my ship and house back, Zeds. A half year ago, it's the same time that Linus joined the gang. Okay, let's go to the prison island. He just picked himself back up. And in the prison island, there was a dragon. It's too sad to hear the story. The only thing we can do is buy some drinks for him. Really? Like, I don't think you want to buy a guy who's already drunk out of his mind more alcohol. That to me doesn't seem like a good idea. So I'm assuming... I'm assuming I could be wrong here. I may have to go back in the town. But I'm assuming that the area that we need to go is the, the area that was cut off at the beginning of this cave. Nice dodge, Hashel. That addition's not so hard to do. Just get, doesn't give any SP at all. Like when you realize, you know, that Shana was getting 70 SP per shot. It's a big difference. Alright. Yep, there's something definitely down here. Ooh, look at that background. It's so pretty. What is that noise? It's from over there. There must be something over there. It's not just something. It seems like the remote the sea dragon is to do. Uh, like that is the dragon's cry. I can't blame you for feeling scared. Uh, 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 like I'm not scared. A uh, dragon too is nothing. We had to look for a way to go to the prison island. There must be a reason for the water not ebbing. Okay, so we need to find... We need to find a way to stop the water? Question mark? I mean, maybe someone in this village knows. And it has at least one side. You know, maybe I had to talk to the guys on the terrace, because one of them was the mayor, right? You, you would think that if anyone knew, it would be the mayor. There's also the gate. Uh, Pete's house, Ocean Terrace. There's also the gate back there as well. Yep, that did it. Sorry, I'm in the middle of something. Here we go. How's this? Darn, not again. Well, I got a good win. Let's take a break. And what do you want? 
We want to go to the prison island, but we cannot go because of the flood tide. We were wondering if there's any other way to go. It said the prison island. Are you serious? You want to commit death or something? We are serious, but we don't want to die. You know it's dangerous to go there, young man, but why? Why would you want to throw yourself into danger? Uh, danger attracts me. Danger is my male name. We need to see the monster. Uh, we need to see the monster. I need to see the monster. We need to see the monster? You look so serious. The appearance. You're worries, aren't you? I got it. We'll tell you. But it's up to you whether you can survive there or not. I closed the route to the prison island after the problem, monster problem arose. Why don't you close the whole cave? It's really dangerous. Well, then we won't be able to go far now. That's why I closed the only path to the prison island. I have a question. How do you control the tide? It's puzzling me. I oh, don't be so puzzled. I just closed the gate to the sea when the tide was full. Then, even after the tide was ebbed, the water level won't go down. Oh my, what a simple trick. Ah, oh, you imagine I could think of something complicated? Ha ha ha! Hey, open the gimmick game for them! I got it! Oh, that's what that was. I thought that, like, swung across somewhere. Go to the cave for the right side of Pete's house. Turn the valve, and he can open the gate. Then he can go to the prison island. Sweet! Looks like we know what we're gonna be doing in the next episode. Kinda wanna get set up for it first, though. Uh, this one? Double chest. Healing rain. Healing fog? Yeah, I assume healing rain is a full HP. I think I've seen that before. What the heck is a fog? Completely because HP, completely because HP fall. So obviously the rain is a more superior fog. Uh, why don't we go ahead and discard a healing pot for two? Turn this valve should open the gate. I love how we're not even turning it. <laughs> I mean, game limitations back then. Now we could go to Prison Island. I mean, it's just the way things were. I like, can't always have perfect uh, graphical interfaces and you don't need it either. It's fine. Not a big deal. I love how he runs all the way around. Oh, that's great. I mean, you kind of ha would have to do that, but it's just... I, I, it's the small things in life that make me happy. And uh, to know that the, the shopkeeper had to go up and down to this guy having to go around. It's just so cool. Alright. Where does he count? Now the water should be gone, right? Yes, it is. Fight attack ball. Kind of useless. Alright, my friends. Well, my name is the Flightless Bird. This is your story based gaming channel. And our continued fine let's play of Legend of Dragoon for PlayStation. Uh, much love to you all. When we come back next episode, we'll be going through the uh, the cave here and possibly fight a, a dragon. That sounds awesome. Can't wait. Until next time. So long. Oh, by the way, have a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day. So long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.